Are you super overwhelmed by what you have on your to-do list? You might not even want to look at your to-do list or make one because you think it's gonna be so long and you don't know how you're gonna be able to tackle it all. This video is for you because I'm gonna give you two really simple strategies that remove and reduce the stress from everything swirling around up here and the worry and the fear and the overwhelm about everything that you have to get done. And it's gonna help you actually tackle some of those things on your to-do list. So as human beings, I want you to know we usually over or underestimate how much we, how much time something's gonna take, how much money it's gonna take, uh, how much we owe in taxes over or underestimate. By having everything from swirling around on here and an unknown and the worry to getting it down onto a piece of paper in black and white, it completely changes it from an unknown worry to maybe a known worry, but it does help to write it down. So what I'm gonna suggest is you set the timer for 45 minutes and here I go again with the mono focusing for 45 minutes and you're gonna make a to-do list. But before you do, here's an easier way to make the to-do list. You already have it semi-categorized in your brain what you have to do. You kind of know, I've got these legal things I gotta figure out. Maybe I've got these accounting things. Maybe I've got these sales things I gotta figure out on my website. Maybe I've got scheduling stuff I've gotta figure out. And maybe there's the stuff I gotta research, right? So you make up these categories, you label these categories or these buckets, if you will. And when you do the 45 minutes, you put stuff into those buckets, right? So now you have this written down and it's in black and white. It's not complete yet but you have it down there and you can see it. And even if it's long, even if each category has a lot of stuff in the buckets, it's no longer swirling around here as an unknown. So that really does help. Then secondarily, now when you're going about your day and you remember something, you don't have to keep it up here as a tally. Now you actually have a place where you can go, oh yeah, I've already started a legal to-do list. I've already started something I need to talk to my accountant about. I've already started something about, do I need Calendly? How am I gonna have clients schedule me? So it really helps to have some place to house all of this. And in another video, I'm gonna talk about how we tackle each bucket. But right now, the goal of my these two strategies is to have it the worry and the overwhelm and the swirling be stopped and significantly reduced by you putting it down on paper. And I promise, no matter how overwhelming it seems, it's gonna feel so much better to have it down on paper and not have it occupy so much mental real estate. That brain of yours is precious and it's only got so much time and energy to focus on things. And I want you to do a data dump down onto paper of all the things that you think you have to do. That's your back pocket strategy for the week. Make it a great week.